All right, hey, first and foremost, I'd like to give all praises. Let me turn this volume mm. off. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweshai, Bahashim Rakakwadash, double honest to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. We are the Hebrew Israelites, which consists of the Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, Simo, Indians, West Indians, and Haitians. And according to the Holy Scriptures, we're God chosen people. Shalom to all the brothers out there pushing his knowledge and sincerity and truth. Shalom to the few sisters. <clears throat> Shalom to the Israelite foreigners who are scattered abroad. Also, also over here in the United States, looking like the other nations. And um, what you're looking at is a true depiction of the one eagerly called Jesus Christ, whose real name in the Hebrew is Yahweh Shai. <clears throat> okay? And what you're looking at is a true depiction of the one eagerly called God, also Jehovah, whose real name in the Hebrew is Yahweh. And when you call upon your power, you must say Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai. Bahashim means in the name, the Hebrew tongue. Okay? So yeah, the Mosai and his, and his son are, are so-called black men according to the scriptures. Okay. So right now what we what we witnessing is demise is the demise of Esau, the so-called white man power structure being totally destroyed according to the holy scriptures, according to prophecy. All right? The year of prophecy, man. Okay? Um through the through, through the inspiration and power of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, the one, the one he can call God and Jesus Christ. He has put the spirit on our apostles and elders, even before them, to come out here and teach his word in sincerity and truth the right way. To reel in the elect. That's it. If you're not part of the elect, Lord will I am and the rest of the brothers, you're not going to make it. <clears throat> because an end has come upon the four corners of the earth. Okay, these are very serious times and very re rejoiceful times the only thing we fear is the most sign and son yahweh by shimmy shy for us brothers who are you know what i'm saying been in the trenches for quite some time we know we put our trust and hope in yahweh by shimmy shy through faith and the word faith means belief and how, how we show forth our belief by going out there teaching the word against all odds against what your family said Friends, women, whatever, losing jobs, you know, you know what I'm saying? Losing homes, losing car, whatever it is, kind of all dumb to gain the respect of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, man. You're not, you're not able to see your children like you used to. It's for a reason, man. You're going you're gonna to get it all back a hundredfold in the kingdom. Mosai is purging us, is purging us in this fire to be hardened men so we, so we can be able to able bodies to stand in the time of judgment that he's bringing, he's about to bring upon this earth, man. Okay? So you got to be really uh, chiseled and tried in that fire to be able to withstand what's about to happen. You understand what I'm saying? It's not a joke. It's not a game, man. Giving all praises to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. But yeah, man, these are very serious times and rejoiceful times. Because after this so-called white man's kingdom, it's going to be the Lord's kingdom. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai's kingdom. And we're going to be joint heirs, Lord willing, underneath him to rule, to rule over the whole planet Earth in righteousness and these different galaxies and planets. So um, <clears throat> I got some videos I want to show you, you know what I'm saying, that I, that I received today about everything, you know, not everything, but certain things that's going on on the planet. This first video I'm going to show is from the, um, one of the um, beautiful brothers in Dallas, the brother Shaar. They're mobilizing out there in Dallas with, uh, you know, this this whole scenario of the coronavirus and how the most size allow Esau to globally lock things down. Even if we so-called go back to normal, it's not going to be normal. You understand? They, they can't let this crisis go to waste. They can see that the ships, the chariots out there in um in space moving, man. So they know they have a short time. So I'm gonna play these few videos over here in North America and also in South America. From the videos I receive from beautiful brother, brother Dawada in this camp, let you know it's some very, very serious times. And for you all all you false prophets out there, you're gonna fucking you're gonna mourn and weep. 
with your with your motherfucking crusty asses, man. Even in Israel, okay, because you're under a one, a one, what you call a five and one C three charter. GMS bums and all that, and we're not incorporated, man. We're under Yahaba Shimmy. I was shy, man, but you know, it's another video. All right, here in Dallas or Fort Worth. That's where I'm working at. This post office. That's right. So, so the most I got Esau mobilizing for this last war, because uh, for us to receive a kingdom, we, hey man, <clears throat> it's gonna be war and violence, man. You understand? But the Lord is gonna, it, man, the most is gonna give us, give certain men a uh, uh, spiritual power, what they call meta humans, man. It's gonna be an easy work, you know. Even especially when the Lord returns. Uh, with Mike of the Archangel man shooting laser beams, it's gonna be easy work. So we ain't got nothing to work, nothing to fear, man. So I'm gonna go to this, these videos the brother sent of um South America, and Peru, and I believe Ecuador real quick. It's not a game out here, man. Four years of lights out here have been bullshitting, thinking this thing is a joke. Your, your ass gonna be curled up like a goddamn cheese doodle, man. Curled up like a goddamn shrimp. You know, serious. Fucking shit is gonna be out here, man. These buildings are gonna be on fire, blown up, people getting killed, shot, whatever, man. You know, get ready to defend yourself, whatever it is, man. The most I gonna test your nuts. You know, the most I about to separate the men from the boys, man. So Lord willing, we all those men has been predestined, predestinated, preordained. Okay, the tabernacle of David. Colón y Malecón, sí. Colón y Malecón, en el Alejandro Man, ya un. Dead body. Y ahora sí vamos. Just like that, laid out. Nobody gives a fuck. That's in the third world countries, man. And that's coming here. So I got a phone call for one of my family members saying, you know, somebody passed away. And they try to take that, that, that person to the hospital in Brooklyn. No beds are available. No respiratory, uh, uh that respiratory ma machines. Are, so that person died in the motherfucking apartment or house, bro. And the Mosai wrote these these things aren't in the scriptures, man. Your your dead body shall be cast out as dung. Who who's the crazy ones now? And this is only the beginning, man. Man, all you mockers and scoffers, check this out. Con ese cadáver y ese pobre guardia le toca trabajar con él a tres metros en la ciudad de la Kennedy. Lay it out. Lay it out, man. So y'all think this ain't gonna come to America? The Lord has got his place systematically being shut down. All right? En la Marta de Roldón ya van llevando, no esperemos que sea, parece un cadáver, chicos. Grábalo, grábalo. No la quieren atender, qué pena. People dropping dead, family members trying to take him to wherever, man. This is what you call, this is not a tank. This is what you call an, an amphibious assault vehicle, AAVs, you know, which they have the armor and all that. You, man, listen, man, the Lord about to fuck you people up, man. You about to, you about to meet the old Alashadja spirit on your ass, man. And judgment has been given to his son, who you have mocked and scorned. All right? So Yahweh Shai is in the forefront of this, man. The way you could call G you people are gonna be fucked up out here, man. Women wanna still act like, man, fuck these people, man. Like Apostle Gabar did a video, man, about the IRT. You're on your own, bros. Or about these motherfucking people. We got the truth. We got the truth, man. Oh. 
So yeah, man, y'all, y'all think it's a fucking game, right? So yeah, man, it's come, it's gonna come here. All you Jakes that still wanna turn up wherever you at, man, the Lord gonna gonna lay you at, lay your ass down, man. That's what Esau wants wants you you Israelites to do, man, which we want you to do too. You know, get get disobedient and go do you, man. Get this thing cracking, you motherfuckers, man. Ah, oh, man, Ezekiel seven verse one. Moreover, the word of the Lord came unto me, saying, Also thou son of man, thus said the Lord, power unto the land of Israel. So, hey, right now, Israel is like the sand of the sea. We are a people before there is a place. So the Lord is going to judge you, man, wherever you at, man. North America, South America, Asia, Europe, Africa, Australia. Not only you, the rest of the nations as well. Because we have Shai is coming back as the kings of kings, and the lords of lords to conquer and to con uh, coming back as a conqueror to conquer. You 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 stupid ass people, man. All right, if if you're getting offended, don't watch the show, man. All right, it says an end. The end has come upon the four corners of the earth. That means north, south, east, and west. This globe. All right, end of a time, an end of a period. The end of the so-called white man power structure. When you go through Daniel the seventh chapter, it breaks it down of different nations that was going to rule on the planet. And after that is the Lord's kingdom. And that's going to be forever. Now is the end come upon thee, and I will send my anger upon thee, and I will judge thee according to thy ways. And I will recompense upon thee all thy abominations. So talking to the beloved brother, man. Going to NLT on your ass on this. It says, no hope remains, for I will unleash my anger against you. I will call you to the account for all your dis detestable sins. Keep celebrating Christmas, eating that goddamn abomination food. You're doing committing adultery, being murderers, drug dealers. The Lord's going to judge you. All right. Like one bro in um Trinidad, bros are still with us in, in GMS, uh uh posted a video on the what uh, on the Marco Polo of their curfew. They're not playing in these third world countries, man. Okay. So when it's time for curfew in Trinidad, they play that motherfucking um purge shit. Driving around, cop cars driving around doing that, man. That's psychological warfare, man. The Lord ain't playing with you fucking people, man. Because now is the end come upon thee, and I will send my anger upon thee, and I will judge thee according to thy ways, and I will recompense upon thee all thy abominations, and my eyes shall not spare thee. Now that I have pity, but I will recompense thy ways upon thee, and thy abominations will be in the midst of thee, and he shall know that I am Yahweh. People are going to know that the most I doing this, man. N.O.T. Real quick, man, for you slow bellies out there. It says, I will turn my eyes away and show no pity. I will repay you for all your det detestable sins. Then you will know that I am Yahweh, man. You people going to learn to fear the most high, man. You're going to learn. Thus said the Lord God in evil and only evil. Evil means bad times. Behold, it's come. And end is come. The end has come. It watches for thee. Behold, it has come. The morning has come unto thee, and thou that dwellest in the land. The time has come. The day of trouble is near. 
and not the sounding again of the mountains, man. So I got to go to the NLT for you. Oh, people of Israel, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, and Simo Indians, man, and those scattered abroad. The day of your destruction is dawning. The time has come. The day of trouble is near. Shouts of anguish will be heard on the mountains. No shouts of joy. See that? Now will I shortly pour out my fury upon thee and accomplish my anger upon thee. And I will judge thee according to thy ways. I will re recompense thee for all thy abominations. All right? You motherfuckers, man. All right? And then my eye, it says, end my eye shall not spear. And now that I have pity, I will recompense thee according to thy ways and thy abominations that are in the midst of thee. That he shall know that I am Yahweh that smited. Behold the day. Behold it is come. The morning is, 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 the morning is forth. The rod had blossomed. Pride had budded. Gotta go to NLT on you. The day of judgment is near. Your destruction awaits. The people's wickedness and pride have blossomed to full flower, man. You people have accomplished your wickedness, man, to the highest level. Starting with Esau on the way down. Who, who, who took it on the, 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 the ways of duels thou wilt spirit. You motherfucking monkeys, man. You're going to be paid. You're going to get judged, man. Violence is risen up into a rod of wickedness. None of them shall remain, nor of their multitude, nor of any of theirs. Neither shall there be wailing for them. Okay? It says their violence is grown into a rod that will beat them for their wickedness. None of these proud and wicked people will survive. And their wealth and prestige will be swept away. Money, the money system will be obsolete real soon, man. Okay? Since the time has come, the day draw it near. Let not the buyer rejoice, nor the seller mourn, for wrath is upon all the multitude thereof. Okay? For the seller shall not return to that which, to that which is sold, Although they were yet alive, for the vision is touching the whole multitude thereof, which shall not return. Neither shall any strengthen himself in the iniquity of his life. Man, all everything, man, listen. Let's see what the NLT say. Even if the merchants survive, they will never return to their businesses. So that means what? Even out here, people are boarding up their businesses, man. These businesses will get ransacked and, and ran through. For what the Mosai has said applies to everyone. It will not be changed. Not one person whose life is twisted by sin will ever recover. All right? Man, listen. For they have blown the trumpet even to make all ready. But none go to the battle, for my wrath is upon all the multitude thereof. We're the only ones blowing the trumpet, brothers. And we're here gathering the elect for the tabernacle of day because war is upon the four corners of the earth. We wait for the deliverance of the, our, Lord, our Lord and Savior. Brothers against spiritual power to protect themselves and their, and their families and even other brothers of the, of the one third and their families. Yeah, that's all catastrophic. And crazy is going to be out here, man. The what? The four corners of the earth. The sword is without and the pestilence and the famine within. We already in the pestilence that Esau is using to scare the public with. It is working. He that is in the field shall die with the sword. What is the modern day sword? All right. These different weapons people have out here. The military weapons. And he that is in the city, famine and pestilence shall devour him. All right? 
There is a war outside the city and disease and famine within. Those outside the city walls will be killed by enemy swords. Those inside the city will die of famine and disease. There's no escape. The most high judgment. You got to be part of the elect. And Lord willing, we are. But they that escape of them shall escape and shall be on the mountains like doves of the valley. All of them mourning everyone for their iniquity. Oh, God, please forgive me. All you bitches out there. All you wicked ass niggas out there, man. Motherfuckers, man. Please, I'm sorry. Speaking whatever language you're speaking. It says the, the, the survivors who escaped to the mountains will moan like doves weeping for their sins. NIV, it says the fugitives who escape will flee to the mountains like the doves of the valley. They shall all moan each for their own sins. That's when you're going to remember all the fucking shit you did, man, to people, man. They also, they shall also gird themselves with sackcloth and, and horror shall cover them. And shame shall be upon all faces and boldness upon all their heads. All right. And I got a, a scripture in the Apocrypha for you, man. DMX say, you think it's a game? You think it's a fucking game, man? This video is going up raw, man. Second is 15. And uh, second is 15 from 57. On it says, thy children shall die of hunger. And thou shalt fall through the sword. Thy city shall be broken down, and all thy shall perish with the sword of the field. They that be in the mountains shall die of hunger, and eat their own flesh, and drink their own blood, for the very hunger of bread and thirst of water. All right? You, you, you hear that, man? Thou as unhappy shall come through the sea and receive plagues again. Well, that's it, man. That, that's it on that, man. So if you're trying to escape, some of you, the Lord said those escape, you're going to die of hunger, man. Eat your own flesh. All right. They shall cast their silver in the streets and their gold shall be removed. Their silver and their gold shall not be able to deliver them. The day, the, in the day of the wrath of Yahweh by Shimei was shy. They shall not satisfy... Set, they shall not satisfy their souls, not to fill their bowels, because it is the stumbling block of their iniquity, man. All right, so that's it on that, man. The Lord is bringing judgment out here. Let's see if I can catch, catch a dead body, man, on the four corners of the earth. And it's only going to escalate, man. It's only going to escalate, man. Let's see if I get one more. This is Laid out, man. No hope. All right. So giving all praises to Yahweh by Shimmy Awashai by Shimmy Kakwadash. Brakate Yahweh. Brakate Awashai. Brakate Yahweh. Brakate Awashai. The water Yahweh by Shimmy Awashai.